Hi guys and welcome to another tutorial for Final Cut Pro X YouTube channel and in this tutorial we're in Blender again our 3D editing package and this is in response to a question that was posted in a comment on one of our YouTube videos where we were making a hydraulic hose and um, I'm going to show you how we created that um, so any type of hose or pipe that maybe you want to have a curved shape and you want to create here in Blender, you'll use um, a couple of tools and one of those is going to be the NURBS curve and the other would be the NURBS circle. Um, so the NURBS curve will be used to construct the path that we're going to then extrude our circle along. So I'm going to switch to my top view and we'll create a NURBS curve and in our right hand panel here for our NURBS curve we're going to change the end point to U and we'll check the U box there. Then we can go over into edit mode and we can now edit the shape of this curve to be the path that we want to extrude along. So we just do that by moving these handles around until you get them into the positions that you desire them to be. So once we've done that, we're going to next go back over into object mode and we'll create a NURB circle. Just move that out of the way. And then we'll scale this circle. And then we'll come back over to our NURBS curve, which is our path. And we're going to choose in our bevel object, NURB circle. You can see now we have the circle extruded along that path making a pipe. Now we can put end caps on this if we don't want it to be hollow. We tick the fill caps box and you'll see that now the ends are filled. You can uncheck that and you'll have a hollow pipe. Now you can make changes still. Um, go back over to our circle there, we hit S to scale. You can still scale the, the pipe however you wish. So any changes that you make to our curve, um, to our circle object, are going to be reflected immediately over there. We can also still um, edit the path. If we select our curve, go to edit mode there. We can still also change the root of the path if we need to. And remember, you can also adjust this in 3D space. So if we go to the front view, you can drag these down so this can be curved in multiple directions so go back into object mode and there we have our bent pipe so that can be made into any shape that we desire um, if we go over to our NURBS curve there We can also make changes to this in our edit mode. We can drag sections out to deform the shape. And you'll see that those changes are also then reflected in our shape, which is being extruded along that path. So, although this isn't circular anymore, we can create it into any type of strange shape maybe that we desire and now you can see that we have that shape extruded along the path so that is how we extrude a shape along a path um, how you can create these um, hoses um, or whatever else it is that you want to do 
you can extrude um, our NURBS shape along uh, a curve in 3D space. So I hope this answered the question that was posted on our YouTube channel and you found this of some use. Thanks for tuning in and I'll see you next time.